Hi ladies, hi gents. Um, I want to share a video with you today <coughs> and it's a design team project for Wild Orchid Crafts and as usual I will pop all the links down below in the description box plus all the product codes of the flowers. Um, I want to show you the products I used first um, before I go ahead and show you the project. Okay. So I used the 40ml trellis roses in the mixed pink and the product code is MKX092 and I actually used this colour pink. I used the 35ml trellis roses in the mixed pink and again the product code is MKX092. <coughs> Again, I used this pink. Um, I used some of the pinky coral colour from the mixed pastel tone chrysanthemums, and this is set C, so there's different sets with different colourways. And the product code for this is QVR031. And the pink I used is this one here, just peeping through. I use some of the mixed pink tone tulip flowers and the product code is MKX143 and I think I use this very pale pink up here, there's not many of them left. <coughs> Excuse me. I then used some of the lily flowers and this is the mixed colour set. And the product code is MKX197. And I used some of the white and this pink one just in here. And some of the white ones. I also used some of the ivory hip rosebuds. And the product code is GST063. And finally, I used quite a lot of the double head stain, uh, pearl staining. And you get 180 in here. And the product code is MKX565. And I did use quite a lot of these. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and show you my project. So it's obviously a heart theme. <laughs> Um, what I did is I got some wire and I shaped it into a heart. Um, it's quite flexible, it still is. And I just covered the wire using a lace, so I just used this vintage uh, dusty pink uh, lace to wrap around the wire. Um, I just liked the colour of it, so that's why I went with this lace. Okay, and then I built up all the roses and flowers with all the stamen and flowers. I just wanted it kind of look um, bridal in a way. <clears throat> I'm still trying to decide which type of hanger I want to put on here. I might put um, seam binding, I'm not sure yet, to hang it up. Um, or use more of the lace. I'm not sure yet. I haven't thought that far ahead. So I'll just show you. So the, there's three of the large trellis roses on here and then one, two of the, the smaller size. And all the way I just wrapped the wires. I'll show you the back in a minute. It's so not pretty in any way. All I did was wrap the wires around uh, the, the heart frame and tied stamen onto the wires as I went along so that it was all hanging here, there and everywhere. Um, then I've got the hip rosebuds, then chrysanthemums and I've repeated that on this side. The tulips are just peeping out here. I've just followed the same pattern um, both sides. And then there's some of the 
off-white lily flowers which have long and stem in it anyway and then more hip rose buds here lots more pearl stamen I really did go to town with the pearl stamen and then there's more of the lily flowers in the pinky colour up here there's a couple of them up here and just just tying the stamen round the, the wires as I went just to um, get the stamen to pop out here, there and everywhere behind the flowers. Um, this was such a simple therapeutic project to do because <laughs> um, you are just wrapping uh, wires around the frame. I'm just going to show you the back and it really is not pretty in any way, shape or form. So you can see where I've wrapped all the wires around with the stamen tied into the wires as I've gone. Um, this is made for hanging up on the wall so it really does not matter what the back looks like. I could cover it um, with more lace but I really didn't see the point when it's going to lay flat against a wall. Um, And I, I had great fun doing it. I love the pearl salmon sticking out everywhere. It's got a real um, wedding feel, I think. Um, I don't use uh, pearl salmon enough in in lots of different ways. I don't use it enough, so um, I'm really glad I've done this project. I will have to buy more pearl salmon now in my next kit because <laughs> I did use lots, as you can see, but. I really love the way it turned out. Um, I hope you like it too and it is a, a simple project to do. A L little bit fiddly tying the wires round but apart from that you know they're not glued on, it is literally just all tied on. Um, so um, you could sit anywhere and do it really which is good. Um, so I really hope you like this project and as I said I will pop all the links down below and all the product codes also for all the flowers that I've used. Please please go check out Wild Orchid Crafts. They have such a beautiful array of flowers and colours and um, I'm sure you'll find something that you love. <laughs> and the Pearl Stamens they do in a lot of different colours as well. I think, I think there might be 10 or 12 colours of Pearl Stamen on on the website. So, um, yeah, please go check them out. Okay, I'll say bye for now, and hopefully I'll be back with another project very soon. Bye.